Hello, and welcome to the second installment of the Island Symphony Orchestra's Artists for Artists, a series of virtual masterclasses for advanced amateur musicians and aspiring young musicians. It's been a, a challenge to find some um, inspiration. And uh, so I, I decided early on, I, I opened my stairwell and mm -hmm. I looked up, up and down and I thought, the acoustics are pretty good in here. So what have, are, do you have any uh, projects now that the, the New, New York Philharmonic is doing? Yes, I am really happy that the Philharmonic started uh, presenting concerts outside. It's, it's called Bandwagon and it's, mm. it's voluntary. They've asked people if they want to play and they have a truck and so they're there and a sound system they're bringing a, a a sound person and lights and the music stands and everything so it's it's very well done and the uh these concerts they're about 25 minutes long mm -hmm. and they they take place in all all of the boroughs So first, Chris, this piece in particular, uh, what would you say are some of the main technical challenges for, for somebody who wants to take this piece on? Well, um, this piece, uh, being a French piece, it's really a, a, it's going to be a different style than playing Mozart or Bach. It's, it's got, um, especially in the first movement, there's just a lot of rubato in the in the um in the slow part of this piece uh this piece is like many of the french pieces from this era with a slow section followed by a fast section and and of course it's great to have a wonderful pianist like i i played with on this video brian um waghorn who is just fantastic. fabulous at 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 being flexible <laughs> 